Hello everybody and welcome back to Promise Gaming and more EU4 Cradle of Civilization playing as at Koyanlu. Okay, uh, we have to kill Persia because I just did some checking around. If we do want to kill Hormuz now, the Mammoths will join. Which means easy chance to take some land from Hormuz, but more importantly, a chance to kill Persia without the Mammoths joining in. It means we'd have to fight a lot of people. Great Horde, Naj, Delhi, stuff I don't like. But it's the only chance I'm going to get to fight them for a while. Unfortunately, Transoxiana is already in a war. Afghanistan's got a truce. Maybe this wouldn't work right now. Uh, this is a rare opportunity. I really want to kill Persia. But if I can't call in any allies, this might be a little tough. That said, I see 16,000 troops, but I'm, is that your entire army? If I can't call in Transoxiana, I'm not sure it's worth it yet. All right, if I had an ally, it would be worth it, but I can't. We'll, we'll, we'll wait for another opportunity. Never mind, never mind. I was hopeful, but I was wrong. All right, let's go over to a uh, high supply depot thing and then just start drilling. Keep our troops nice and strong. Okay, still can't do anything as far as tech. Gonna be a long dang time. Could get some ideas. Um, Circasia, have you been able to convert anything? You have two. Two provinces. Not enough. But it's some progress. We're almost done with Trebizond, actually. And when that happens, we'll have made some pretty significant progress as far as converting uh, our lands. Back up to 84% religious unity right now. That's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. I guess I could go kill Hormuz on my, my own. Is there anything stopping me from just doing that for my own sake right now? Not really. Um, can't fabricate any claims, but that might change once you're done with this war. I don't know. I don't think we need to keep going with the Commonwealth. We're done with that. Can I get any more claims against you? Not until I have 35. Wait a month. That'll do. Mamlukian Australia. There it is, guys. That's the thing. And Kara, grab. When does my truce with them expire? Uh, 1603. 1595 for Tunis, but I don't care about them. I have no Diplo rep at the moment, too, which is a problem. Really would like to vassalize you, but I can't. Not if you're allied to Persia. Well, no, wait a minute. I could call the Mamluks in on this. Oh! Oh, and this is my way of fighting Persia. I, I, I can't co-belligerize them, but it's a way of trying to break up their alliances. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Go, go here. Now, the question is, can I build a spy network on you and get a claim on Circassia's behalf? Uh, and I don't, I don't, oh, wait, wait, I have, oh, I have borders with the Caspian Sea. Okay, we can get a claim on them. This is it. This is what we do. I'm sorry. I'm silly. Okay, this is how we call in the Mamluks. This is how we do things. This is how we do it. Ajuran is out, uh, at war with Persia. Eh, you can have military access if you want. Don't think I care. All right, get up here. All we need to do now is get 20 uh, spy network, and then we can go to war and find a way to fight Persia. Persia, by the way, is now streaming through my lands. I'm going to go ahead and turn on this fort preemptively. Because uh, pretty confident that they're going to get stuck around here. We're going to kill the Great Horde quickly. Hajj Caravans raided. No! It's fine. I don't want to lose that much money. It's way too much. Uh, let's split these guys real quick because we've got too much going on. Netherlands declares independence from Spain. Hello, tiny Netherlands and loon. You're all horribly loony to think you can get away with that. That ain't going to happen. All right, we can actually feed some land to Circassia by doing this, too. Feed them more, more Sunni lands so they have better religious unity. Brabant joins the Republic. Oh, there you go. Flanders, Holland, Utrecht. If all of you join, the Dutch are going to get pretty strong. Which I approve of. I would like that. That'd be cool. Great expectations. I guess I can afford to gain a corruption. It's not great, but all right. Pskov became the vassal of the Commonwealth. This little guy right here? Alright, makes sense. Hmm. Come on, couple more months. Couple more months. I 
I can't drill if it's in my vassal's land? Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that. Oh! Transoxiana lost their war and has to give something to Afghanistan. Oh, hang on. Does this change things? They're still not willing to join. They got debt. 400 ducats of debt, in fact. Now, I could pay their debt, but I'm not going to do that. I found an alternative, which will allow me to fight them. In fact, if I can call in Transoxiana on this war, that'd be great. All right, so that's conversion done. Um, Trebizond, let us cancel the edict. So this is one of the reasons I think I never used edicts, is because it becomes very tedious having to find all the provinces you just converted. But all right. So let's fabricate a claim on Ostrakhan. Okay, that is our pretext for war. Cancel this. We have really good spy network, which translates into a lot of extra siege value against uh, Persia. Believe it or not. 20% extra siege ability. That's really nice. All right. So we can go to war with you. Now the Mamluks won't join. Why? My Diplo rep is so low. Hang on. No, can't make that better. Let's go for this guy, by the way. I prefer to get some money rather than uh, stability cost. I could say prepare for war, but you're already at war. So now I can't. Now, this is still a way for me to fight Persia personally. I just won't get any friends. If I want to declare war on you, what would it take to get Transoxiana in here? You have a lot of debt. 600 ducats of debt? Dude. All right. I think that I'm going to have to fight Persia on my own if I want to do this. I probably can. I mean, they're fighting a war of their own right now, so they're already sort of... They're already sort of distracted. I think I can afford to do this. As long as I don't co belligerize. And I won't. It's worth it. Alright, let's do it. We're gonna kill Persia. Persia's gotta die. Persia's gotta die, die. Split, split, split. Go here, 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 here. Nope, can't. Hang on. Go here, go here. Alright, good enough. Uh, there's 9,000 troops up here. All right. That's okay. Can't go over there. Advisor. Uh, I'll take a new Diplo rep guy. Thank you very much. So I'm definitely going to hand some of this land off to my vassal. We might as well make them stronger. I don't see any reason not to do that. Can't go anywhere. You don't have any military access. I think you're just hiding in a corner in Lower Dawn. And Persia does, in fact, join the war, and they're now trying to siege some stuff down. Okay. Let's get these troops over here. See if we can block them off somewhere, or at least give them a reason not to go crazy. We just need to siege this down as quick as we can. Um, We could spend 50 military power to just barrage them, but I don't see the point. Not right now. Still a little bit off on this, but we're getting closer. Okay, Ostrakhan is down. I guess I'll hold on to it for myself for now. Let's go to Sarai. Let's go here. Hello, I'm here to kill you. Okay, and this is going to do it. All right, General goes down here. You don't have a General. 19,000 troops is enough to deal with this. Let's see if I can get into my own lands real quick, then we'll teleport the general down here. Doop. I wonder if EU4 is ever going to do something like they're, um, they're about to make some changes to Hearts of Iron 4, where uh, it takes some time to transfer a general around. I wonder if they're ever going to do that in EU4. It would make sense, my opinion. But maybe they won't. We'll see. All right, you guys are going to come down here. I see a single Persian troop down here, and I don't know what it's doing. But I guess I don't care that much. All right, let's siege down this fort. Yeah, I don't think that Persia can do much to me right now. Let's go to this fort next. Now, unfortunately, I can't siege this down from Hormuz. Hopefully they lose it, because that is kind of a war goal for me. Uh, because it's my mission. So I'd like to have that. Afghanistan is dead. This extra siege ability, man, 20% extra is a pretty big deal. Super convenient. Great Horde wants out. No, you're the war leader. Flanders joins the Republic. 
Okay, and the Netherlands are fighting Spain. Somehow me thinks that uh, the Netherlands will not be able to get off the ground. Just a guess. All right, so Hormuz is back up here. They've got 13,000 of their own troops. I've split my armies. I'm going to get a new general. I think it's time. Let's recruit. Hello. You'll do fine. Just because we've got a large enough army that I can justify splitting it up into two. All right, that's another siege done. Doop, doop, doop. Utrecht joins the Republic. That's interesting. Go to their capital. So the Netherlands... N no. No. Utrecht joined the Republic. But the Republic then instantly died, and now they're separate again. I don't know what happened there. Social dissent. Uh, mysticism. Or legalism. I think we go for the legalism. We do need to have some more tech and stuff anyway, right? All right, so those guys are going to die. Squish. Oh, hello. Ajuran. Siege it down for Hormuz. Okay. Nothing I can do about that right now. Send in the cavalry. Cavalry combat ability doesn't do a lot for me at the moment. You got any more forts? Yeah, you got one in Bam. All right, let's go to Bam Bam. That'll do. Um, Afghanistan. I don't suppose you want in on this war after all or anything. I can't call any allies in now, so it's unfortunate. We have too much war score. Merchant guilds lose loyalty and the Ulema like me and I gain money. Yes. Can we demand power? Yes. Call a diet. Recruit minister. I can't get enough. I have to give him more land. We're so close to being able to get free uh, military power. Where's something the Amir's control? <sighs> Economic. Nope. Political. Estates. Amir's. Dupe. Dupe. It's not enough. Dupe, dupe. Does that have to recalculate or something? Oh, there we go. 70. Ah, it's so barely not. Wait a minute. No. Oh, 75% is what I need, right? Damn it. All right, just demand what you got. It's fine. Grant Monopoly Charters. I can't do anything with the Merchant Guilds at the moment. And the Ulema. Oh, the Dimi are gone. Wait, why are they? It's because I don't have any. Is it because I don't have any heretics or heathens? It might be. Seek their support. Yeah, I need to get them up to 75%. I, I can't do that. Not easily. We're just... I'm not even going to demand anything because we're already close to the cap. But, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So, Persia's doing something I don't like. Um, as soon as we're done with this fort, we'll go hunt them down. Holland joins the Republic. Oh, you and Trek did join, after all. So, the Netherlands have a small amount of independence, but Spain got a lot of the land back. Sort of awkward, but okay. We'll go with it. Oh, hello. I found your army, apparently. Oops. And it seems that they have finished part of their war. Let's go up here to Sicasia. Let's save them. Yeah, you may have military access if you want. It's fine. So yeah, their ally ditched them, so Hormuz is stuck on their own. Okay. Mm. Where do you think you're going? No, no, no. Come back here. Come back here. No, no, no. No, no, no. Be my friend. Come here. Give me a hug. I am in need of a friend right now. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. How about a friend of me? You got a friend in me. They're dead. Ha <laughs> ha. You suck, Persia. I say you suck, Persia, fully knowing that at some point I'm going to become Persia myself. But, eh, it's funny. All right, we're about to be capped out on this power. Um, definitely not taking any tech until we get this. Okay, we're making some progress. If I made this into a state, I don't suppose this is considered enough of my... What if it is? All right, we're going to try something. Since I have a lot of admin power, let's make this a state. It's going to cost me a lot of money. But... Well, now we have high liberty desire? Oh, it was already done. Okay, so that's done. Now... Ah, oh, we're so close! 8% of my development has the uh, institution. It's not enough, but it's it's better. 
That said, we're also going to make some progress on things like this, so I don't know. If we can get just a little bit more, a little bit more, we'll be able to embrace the institution. Siege of Bam is done. Good. Um, I don't think you have anything else as far as forts. Yes, you do. That's Afghanistan. Nope, that's the rebels. Never mind. Split, split, split. Go here, 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 and here. Okay. Uh, I need to get my troops down here because that is the war goal before Hormuz gets it back. Or rather, that's my mission. Okay, that's a few more Persians dead. Talented judge. Yep. General died. Aw. All right, let's get a new one. Uh, 1332 is not great. It's not the worst ever, but it's not great. We'll give it to you. Thank you. Okay. Go here. Go here. Go here. Go here. And Hormuz is taking this back. <sighs> All right. Can't do anything about that at the moment. Go up here to the capital. I think at some point soon, Hormuz is going to finish their war, and I'm going to want to be able to take that immediately. Nothing else I can do at the moment, though, so we're just going to have to live with it. Go here. Ethiopia has rivaled the Mamluks. Ethiopia. I remember playing as you. You were pretty fun once upon a time. You really were. You were. I'm not joking. Hmm. All right. See some Persians. They're dead. Good. Go here. Go to all those. Oh, wait. They came back. Go here. I want to siege this thing. It is important to me that I succeed. Kill this guy. Thank you. Okay, go here. We'll cut him off. Don't worry. He can't do nothing. He's dead. All right, so I do get a siege just down after all. Awesome. Okay, 900 ducats. We're making a fair bit right now. 10 ducats a month certainly helps. Um, I can't build much in the way of ships or troops. I could go for a bit more taxes. I could go for some more production. Marketplace? Grab that. Edicts. Or Constantinople. 0.07. Yeah, let's go ahead and reduce the state maintenance there. That's reasonable, actually, with a courthouse. Okay, so we have this now. I have a lot of war score against the Great Horde, but not much else anywhere else. Let's kill Persia. Hormuz, I need you to finish your war. I'm even helping unseach stuff for you. Please end your war. You've got their capital. What more do you think you're getting here, okay? That's what I want to know. Let's go siege this crap down. Since we're stuck waiting for a little bit. Doop, do. do. Do, 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 do. Oh, they're already going over there, too. Okay, tell you what. Let's go siege down the stuff that I've got claims on. I want to grab Tehran, absolutely. We'll grab a lot of this stuff. And most important, break off your alliance with the Mamluks, because dang it all, screw that. <laughs> Not allowed. Um, I don't have enough relationships limits to try and take over the Great Horde as a vassal. Their independence is apparently guaranteed by Russia, which I find funny. Can I give this to Circassia after all? Hang on. Can I give Circassia my claim? Is that allowed now? No. That was worth a shot. Okay, go to that. That. Oop. All this goes to you. Yeah, I could just totally eat them and give them all to Circassia. It would upset a lot of people, but I could do that. I might even do that. We'll see. Kind of depends. I'm not going to be able to take a lot from Persia because I didn't co belligerize and claims don't really matter in this case. So, yeah. Uh, capped out on power again, eh? Um, states. That's what we should do. States. States. Is Iraq Arabia not a state? No, it is. Sorry. Karaman. Over here? This should be a state. Absolutely. This will be worth a fair chunk of money. All right. Core. 225 power gone. 
extra state for me means extra money and manpower. Very nifty. Uh, hello, peasants. Let's deal with this real quick. Not that I want to help Persia exactly, but I also really don't want to have to worry about these guys. Go here. Go here. States demand control. The Ulema. Of course they do. Do I have any heretics or heathens? I got some stuff. Nothing a state, though. All right. Something cheap. Cheaper than that. Seven? That'll work. All right. They're happy now. Um, Hungary stopped supporting an heir from their dynasty on the Commonwealth. Ooh, do they not have an heir? No, they got an heir. A Habsburg. The Commonwealth have Habsburgs on the throne. Well, that's scary. Can you imagine any of these falling into personal unions? Be very upsetting, in fact. Looks like a De Valois. Why is this red? Oh, because he's excommunicated. Right, 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 right. Okay, Hormuz finished their war. Good, finally. Okay, so let's make sure we grab all this real quick. I'm not going to be able to take a lot from Persia, but I can at least make them suffer a little bit. I'll definitely take some war reps and so on. We'll grab their uh, capital, though. Definitely just to weaken them. And that's all I'm able to do. Afghanistan could use some more land. I could, if I want to, I could hand land off to Afghanistan. Again, the goal is not just to take land for myself. The goal is for Persia to die so that I can form Persia. That's going to be important to me at some point. But oh well. Let's just wait. Coffee and tobacco. Legalism? Yeah. Might as well. Come on. 57%. I feel like if it's 57%, it's actually like 2%. Alright. So, for you, first and foremost, you break off your alliance with the Mamluks. That's a requirement. Thank you. Then I take your war reps. Thank you. I could even humiliate, and I will. I'm going to then take a little ants. That's all I can do? Oh. Well, I have to take this for a mission. So this isn't a lot of land to take, but it really weakens them. I get money. I get power projection. They lose all of that, and they lose the Mamluks as an ally. Which I'm hoping means that Afghanistan, with the help of Transoxiana, will be able to kill them. And I'm not even spending a lot of Diplo power on this, which I think is going to be good. So, yeah, that seems fine. Revoke a core against me? No, can't do that. Money? I can take 168 ducats from you. Alright, so that's not a lot to take out of Persia, but it finishes a mission and it definitely weakens them. Good enough for me. Done. Thank you. Cool, we even got to fill in that mountain range so we look a little bit bigger than we are. Yes. Okay, mission. Rival of arrival. Make a psalm like me. I guess we'll try. They're, they're a lot weaker now. But alright, sure, why not? We'll, just, we'll do it. And now, great horde, you may give all of your land over to my vassal. And you are out. Okay, Circassia grows. Hooray! That worked out pretty well for me. I like that a lot. How's your liberty desire? It's a bit of a problem. Can I grant them a claim? No, not after the fact. Nope, okay. Okay, that was a splendid little war. Splendid, I tell you. We do have some rebels, but I don't think they're going to be too hard for me to deal with. We'll send these guys over here. You don't want to be... No, I'm not going to make you a march. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Um, so let's see. What's spreading fast? Fast and Trebizond, believe it or not. You know what just occurred to me? I made Karmon into a state, and I think I just reduced my total... Yeah, from 8% down to 7.6. Oops. What I could do is try making states out of this area, for example. There's a bit of development here, and this is all about to embrace it. Well, no, it's not. This has it, but that's it. Ugh, there's no really good way to be getting, um, more. Trebizond getting it is a big deal. We could spend power to kind of help it along, you know? That's allowed. The irony is, if I could get to 15 Diplotech, I'd start getting into my... Excuse me, my capital for free, but it's too much of a penalty to justify that. 
Yeah, we we may want to we may want to consider spending some of my power just to get some development and make things faster. All right, Persia no longer counts as a rival apparently. That's fun. I'll get a claim here, and a claim I did not get to Ron. Okay, yeah, I didn't take that. Oh well. Costly trade embargo against you, huh? All right, Persia has rivaled Hormuz, or H Hormuz, or. Hmm. There are ways to say these things, but I sometimes don't know where they are. Tabritz. I mean, I'd like to make more states, but I need to make sure we get the printing press first. So, no. No more states until that's done. I need to get rid of that 50% tech penalty. Ajuran, amazingly, has sieged down a bit of land from the Mamluks. Which I find amazing. I suspect it's because the Mamluks, one, have left their troops in Cyprus, and two, have too many troops... Uh, still in Australia or something. The Ottoman Separatists are coming back, huh? No, you're not. No, you're not. We're going to split the army. Send some of them this way. No Ottoman Separatists for you. Thank you. All right, we got a lot of power we're sitting on right now. Way too much. Way too much. Playing the courts. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, we'll just let you drill for a little bit, I guess. Got a lot of money that I'm sitting on, too. But that's because I want to spend it on this. I don't know how much it's going to cost me, but I imagine it's a lot. Uh, okay. So, Trebizond, I need you to have this now. We're going to spend a little bit of power. Mostly admin, I think, to help you get it. Okay. Okay. So it's going up by 1.42 per month. 1602. Two years. Two more years, and we'll be able to get it in Trebizond. Then it should start spreading into the rest of my uh, land. And I'm hopeful that that's going to be good enough to try and get the printing press going. All right. All right. That'll have to do. Well, Lakia took more land off of Hungary, by the way. Hello. You are really making good use of your alliance with the Commonwealth, aren't you? Yes, sir, you are. Fascinating. Civil War in Saxony. Yeesh. Uh, I just realized you want a military... You don't need military access from me. Why? There's there's no point. You can't use it. I don't know what you think you're doing. Let's improve relations with them for a bit. So I still have a truce with the Ottomans. I can get a new rival. I could rival the Mamluks, but... Eh. I mean, I want to use the Mamluks in one more war against the Ottomans, so no, I don't think that makes a lot of sense. Eventually, we'll want to rival them. It'll be a good way to break off the relationship so I can try to kill them, but not yet. Oh, look, another institution is fired. Yay. All right, what kind of progress are we going to have on this one, huh? Good news is we're actually getting it in quite a few places. Uh, mostly because I have marketplaces. Right. Do I have one in Constantinople? I have to imagine I do. Yeah, I do. Um, nowhere else amazing for a marketplace. Hmm. Nah, we'll hold off. We'll hold off. It's fine. It's fine. Whoop! Okay. Oh, no! My good air died! No! I'm gonna lose 50 prestige and get rid of this guy. He sucks. All right, here's hoping that, um, yes, here, here, here's, here's hoping that, uh, <laughs> if I die, I'm okay. I'm 58, maybe I can get a new heir. I mean, I do have the whole established cadet branches, so the chances are pretty decent, but, yeah, let's hope I can get a better heir than that. I just lost 50 prestige, but I am not accepting a 101. I'm sorry, that is so bad. Man, what happened to, like, my 4-6 guy? He was so good. Oh, well. Improve relations with Hormuz. Uh, yeah, I guess. All right. All right, let's improve relations with you for a little bit. I plan on killing you anyway, eventually. What? Why? What What happened? Why can't I... Why did it immediately fail? What happened? Decline. I don't know. Can I fall under, like, personal unions and stuff, by the way? I don't think so. An Aquilian noble succeeds to the throne. It doesn't say anything about 
Yeah, I don't think there's personal unions if I'm going to go for the Muslim faith. Man, that sucks. I was so looking forward to having that guy. I should have abdicated is what I should have done. Of course, apparently he would have just died, so it wouldn't have actually worked out. But still, that sucks. Man. Oh, well. Oh, well. All right. 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 So what do we do next? Probably kill the Ottomans again when we get a chance. I'm shocked they haven't broken yet. They should have. But they are only allied to Bashkiria. Transoxiana is actually willing to start joining wars now here. So, yeah, I'm going to kill the Ottomans. I'll definitely call these guys in. I think the Mamluks have a truce, and once that's gone, they probably would be willing to join as well. So, yeah, this would be another chance to just beat the ever-loving snot out of the uh, Ottomans. Take a lot of lands, fill in the border gore. Maybe even finish off Shervin and feed some more stuff to Circassia. I'm not too sure yet, but there's a lot of options for us. That's probably what we're going to do on Monday. Um, and with the Mamluks not allied to Persia anymore, that makes things a lot easier as far as killing them later. So, yeah, once that truce expires in 1614, I think we call in all of our allies and we start killing Persia. Once Persia is down and just actually gone from the game, I probably can form Persia and I'll be of the Empire rank. And then we'll get to experience the whole um, theocracy and stuff. Which will be fun. After that's done, we start killing the Ottomans and eventually try to form Rum. Or however you're supposed to say that. I have no idea. Does that sound good to all of you? Because I think it sounds pretty good to me. Um. Wait. Oh. What? Mm -mm. Might be worth embracing these guys, I just realized. A Shriki? So it's not as much penalty. Georgia. Hang on a second. I was about to I was about to end the video, but let's wait a second. 33 Um Shriki's down here. So it's not it's not as bad. It'd be better to yeah. 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 Let's um let's embrace uh let's embrace the Georgian culture real quick to spend some of my power to do that. Okay. Going to end this video here. Thank you all very much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. If so, be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, hit notification and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.